is our door and the creepy vanity right here. Like the lock is really weird. It's not like a normal hotel lock. It like has little holes in it that unlock the door. It's so oh. the door is open and we left it closed. We closed it. I remember hearing it close. If someone's in here, honestly, like I will like throw out the window. It's in here. <laughs> Look, Thank how you. far does it go down, Brittany? Oh Do my gosh. Does it see that? Manny, don't move. What? what, what? Is Look how big that's it? So we have the key to room 201. I can actually believe we got it. If there's anyone in this room who wants to communicate with us, can you please talk to us through the spirit box in my hand? So we're in room 201, which is supposed to be one of the most haunted rooms here at the mansion. Okay. If there are any spirits in this room who would wish to speak with us, who want to speak with us, can you please communicate with us through the spirit box right here in my hand? If there's anyone in this room who wants to communicate with us, can you please talk to us through the spirit box in my hand? Can you tell us your name? We've heard of a woman spirit that likes to tuck people into bed. Are you the one that is in this room? <gasps> no! Because it's a man. That was a man. That was a deep no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. That was a serious okay. no. So it's a man. Thank you for letting us know that. That's great. What is your name? And are you okay with us being in this room? Did you follow us from uh, downstairs, the crawl space? Were you just in the crawl space with us? I was. Or you heard I, I heard I heard crawl space. I heard I was. Maybe it's one of those. One of the other. That's creepy. Are you happy here? Are you the owner of the, the original owner of this place? There's a, there's a man that sweeps and tends the fireplace. It's very well known. Are you that man that helps? Is that Brittany? That's what I thought I heard too. <gasps> what the hell? Oh my gosh! Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold my hold on. form. I just want to say thank you so much. And if you can say that again, this is literally oh my, my dream. God. My eyes are getting watery. This is literally my dream. If I have chills all over my body. You said Brittany, please say it again. Can you touch me? Honestly, do anything. I live for this. Like, that means the world to all of us. Oh my god, Mandy. Oh my god. I cannot believe that this happened. Oh my god. Are you okay? Just yeah. Okay. Whoa. Do you... Is it me that you want to speak to? It said Britney. It said Britney. Right when you were like, I think it said Britney. Was Britney. It was Britney. It was so creepy. Oh my god, like was mad at me. I, this is literally a dream come true for Britney. So <laughs> yeah. continue doing what you're doing. We're really thankful. Yeah. We, we're only allowed in this room for so long, like, but we really genuinely want to go deep into this. Like, we want to know why you're here. We want to know who you are. Let yourself be known. Close the door. Turn on the tap. Turn on the TV. Push me, like, say something. Say something. So you can turn the water on, like the tap on in the bathroom. If you can show yourself, that would just be amazing. Oh, it's got chills. All the hair, like, went up on my arms after. The Britney were like, oh! <laughs> Amanda. Stop. No, I didn't. Can you say Jessica's name? Brittany. <laughs> you want me to lay down? I heard Jonathan. Do you want me to lay down? I've heard everyone's name except for me and Luca. Can you say Jonathan? You guys have that deep voice? There's a deep voice. That, yeah, it's coming through it's constantly. So deep. We might catch what he's saying on yeah. editing. The Britney. That was just okay. clear as it day. It was so clear. That was so clear. I got chills. Okay, what do you think of Tanacon? <laughs> 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 
Does one do it? Does one turn off the machine and try to get knocking? Okay. Okay. It's like our signature thing we do. That was insane. We all jumped. <laughs> Brittany, we're like, oh. Okay, so we're gonna, I guess, do what our signature thing is to do is try to communicate with knocking. And obviously, the spirit in here wants to communicate. So, do you wanna? Let's do it. Knock once for yes and twice for no. <laughs> if you're here, just knock once for yes and twice for no. Copy this sound. Can you please do that for us? If, is there anything you want to say? Can you pull my hair, scratch my back? So my back is like full out open. They want to like leave marks on me or something. We were getting more from the spirit box. Yeah. I cannot wait to go into the underground tunnels. Okay, so we have like five minutes. Should we put the spirit box back on? Or do you five minutes? Okay. Any final words you would like to say to us, please say them through the spirit box. Can you tell us your name or any names of the spirits here? <laughs> They're just playing with us. We really appreciate what you've done for us in this past 25 minutes that we've been in this room. Like, it's mind blowing. And if you can do more than that, we would love that. Can, can you say boo? Ooh. Can you say one of our names again? It's so creepy. That it is. It's like there's so many voices. That like it's so hard much. to tell what's the radio and what's a voice coming through. It's a deep voice that was like, what the? I really truly think that it's the owner because that's the only male. the only male they they see around, and it's like it's mostly women that were here. Mm -hmm. It was girls, and it was a monastery for nuns. And the man is the man died halfway through building this place and they buried him somewhere close by so i feel like that's him okay any last words because we're about to leave can you say bye to us you say that we'll leave that's confusing <laughs> yeah so oh my god the britney was as clear as a bell yeah and we right. all heard it. We're you know like, how sometimes we <laughs> interpret things? Yeah. But it's like we all heard it. Jesse Flake. I know Jesse Flake over there. I jumped. I didn't even realize I was jumping. <laughs> spirit box session really quick here while there's nobody around mm -hmm. um let's right. do this let's do this we would love to communicate with the spirit that is in this lobby we've heard that you are usually by the fireplace work work i'm, I'm working working, yeah, working. Yeah. do you want to talk to us we've also heard that books have flown off the shelves. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so we would love it if you can make a book fly off the shelf. Can you make those doors over there shut? Can you turn the fire on? We hear that you're the one that haunts the lobby. The feel and the vibe that I'm getting is that there's like a ton of them. Mm -hmm. And like there's so much going on. Yeah. There's nothing to do with like the radio frequencies or whatever. I understand that that's a factor, but I just feel like there's there's just and it's not that they're specifically trying to communicate with us. It's just that they're doing their own thing. There's so many spirits here that are just doing. Their so own it's thing. hard to even pick up one yeah. voice because there's so many. Yeah, and it's like they don't care too much to talk to us. They're just doing their yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah maybe. they're just interacting with themselves. Yeah. They're just living their lives here. What is it saying? I literally heard like from four different voices here. Here, yeah. here. Is there a lot of you? Sounds like kids' voices sometimes. That was him. Is there anything you want to say to us? Wake, wake up. up. That was so clear. Yeah, every so often that clear voice comes through. Bedtime. Bedtime. Are you a nun? 
Oh Were you Maybe the teacher here? To bed. It was only like 10 o'clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the kids would have gone to bed. Wait, wait, wait. I want to speak with the woman who was just talking. Can you continue talking to us? I got a really good vibe from her. I don't know. I just got this like comforting vibe. So right now it is 1 a.m. and we're heading down to the tunnel, which is just down these stairs here. We hope we don't wake anybody up because it is 1 a.m. and everyone's sleeping. So guys, let's go. This is such an eerie tunnel. Echoes. It's so echoey. I thought it was going to be creepier though, like when we see... I don't know, like it'd be darker and... We could probably turn oh, off the lights. Used to be. Is there some footsteps? <gasps> was there? You heard footsteps? Like, like little footsteps? Oh, I just got chills. It's like a microphone. Why is it sound like we're over there? Okay, I heard like... That's so scary. Oh my god, imagine we get stuck in here. I already don't like it. I feel like... There's a camera right there. He's I probably like watching really us. Close. So what are we going to do? Are we going to do a spirit box session? Yeah. So we're in the underground tunnel, and we want to speak with anybody who's in these tunnels with us. Does anyone here who wants to speak with us, please communicate with us with um, the spirit box? I'm so sorry. Is there anybody here who wants to talk with us? Mm -hmm. This is no one. Always happens earlier in the night. I think, I think it's literally something to do with our energy level, though. Yeah. So our energy level always dies down. We could, like, sleep and set an alarm. You know, like, have a few hours to sleep and then maybe set an alarm at three or something and go into the lobby. Because, yeah, that's when she said stuff happens at three. It's true. What time is it now? One. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Recharge our energy. Yeah. Kind of thing. Okay. Do it. Do it. I would do it. I would do it too. Yeah. Thank you.